Right, what we're going to do is probably the easiest pasta dish um, you can imagine. Uh, basically three main ingredients. Fresh pasta, worth getting the fresh stuff um, as opposed to the dried up stuff you can get in the supermarkets. Wild rocket um, and cherry tomatoes. Uh, as you can see from the receipt here, grand total of, what does it come to? £1, £2.39, £3.39. So uh, pretty cheap all round. Uh, and uh, should take under 10 minutes to cook as well, which is a bonus. We've cheated slightly in that we've got some boiling water on the go, but you can boil some water in a minute anyway, so that's no problem. Um, okay. Uh, it's Are we start. ready to time? I am ready to time. Okay. Um, on your marks, get set, go. <laughs> yeah, right. So, first up, just get the pasta itself into the boiling water. And this pasta takes five minutes to cook. Um, from the time it goes into the pan, just going to take the uh, water back up to boiling first. Just get that under there. Uh, now, worth adding a little bit of salt uh, to this mix as well. And we've got a little bit of salt just in here. Let's, uh, with the smallest salt spoon in the <laughs> world. Uh, we must have something better than that. Uh, but there's different. salt in that cupboard. Okay, cool. Um, right, so just got a little bit of sea salt here. Not too much. A little bit, which is now just sitting on top, so we'll just stir that in and that should be fine. Okay, right now, next up, we are just going to cut the cherry tomatoes in half just to, to open them up. Again, this is very quick and easy to do. You don't How? need to do all of these, but uh, you're just going to get a good. And don't panic, again, Harry. <laughs> how, what, how are we doing for time so far? Is uh, so far, I have no idea. I think we're around two minutes. Okay. Have you not timed it properly? Yeah, I am timing. It's just there's no light and uh, right, okay. play anymore, so I can't really see. Okay. And uh, this is going to be for four people as well. So if you think of it in terms of value for money, um, that's pretty good. It's under a pound a person, so that's pretty good. Um, yeah, unfortunately this isn't the most exciting part of the whole process <laughs> of cutting tomatoes, but it needs to be done. And uh, basically what's going to happen is, uh, a bit further down the line, once we've uh, we've drained the pasta uh, after it's five minutes of cooking, um, we're just going to add in the tomatoes and also the uh, the rocket as well. Uh, just going to mix it all together with a bit of parmesan some, maybe. Yeah, some parmesan, which we need to grate, that's a good point. Um, and just then with olive oil and uh, some ground black pepper as well. Um, I am maybe being presumptuous, but uh, I'm hoping that, uh, that people are cooking. They've got both of these uh, in their kitchen um, as it is, so I haven't put those into the cost of things as well. Um, and the parmesan, it's a nice extra, uh, but if you haven't got it then, it's not the end of the world. Uh, any other sort of hard cheese would do the job as well. Right, just gonna do a couple more of these tomatoes. Oh, we may have a and pasta situation. Oh, oh no! Don't zoom in on that. Don't zoom in on that. <laughs> we have a slight pasta situation. Um, right, have you done hang this on. Time? Let's just get the extractor fan on. Okay. That's a light. Okay. Right, let's get those bits off. I am the worst. <laughs> so, Harry actually managed to burn pasta. <laughs> Which I thought was quite an impossible task, but... Yeah, I've never no. seen that done before. Okay. This is uh, how we roll at Temptation. <laughs> yeah, this is highlighting just how good we are. Um, <laughs> Maybe I'll just go and have another look at these yeah, ingredients okay. while you yeah, sort take, your left take over doing some little... Uh, no. so just to run through that again, we've got tomatoes, minutes. chocolate, no, 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 it's going to be minutes, I've we've seen got two. some uh, Italian extra virgin olive oil, uh, black pepper, Tomato and that brandy has nothing to do with it. Actually, do you want to get out the parmesan? Do you guys want to have a little oh, yeah. look? Oh yeah, let's have a little look for some parmesan. Um, it's yeah, it'll be in here somewhere. Right. You can take over the camera for a second, Daisy. Yeah, I'm not that tall. Here we go. Parmesan. We've got parmesan. This is how much we love parmesan in the Vaughan family. <laughs> We've got a special little parmesan grater. Are you kidding me? No, I'm not kidding you. You can also but buy grated, you know. It does have parmesan in it. So yeah, so how, let's go back to how Right, okay, so uh, yeah, after that minor, minor debacle, we've got uh, got things back on track. Hopefully it won't uh, all spill over again. Oh, I'm just going to take my bar. Okay, how, uh, how are we looking time-wise on that? I have no idea. Just press on the manual button. You'll say... <laughs> so yeah, so far we are 4 minutes 14 in. 
Okay. Um, yeah. Given the pasta went in after about 30 seconds, we're starting this. We've got about another minute before we need to drain it, so it can be fun. We've, We've got, got the drainer the already, already in the sink. Uh, the other nice thing about this recipe is no matter how basic your kitchen, um, it's really easy to do. All that we're going to use for this is just the hob, um, which is now covered in pasta, um, and that's about it. So you should be able to, to cook in most kitchens. Okay, now going back quickly to finish off the last couple of tomatoes. Uh, that's fine. And then also we're just going to open up this rocket as well. Just stops the dish from being bland gives it a bit of texture two okay we can have a quick kind of a just to check yeah. whether the pasta's okay. done thank you so. i'm just gonna lay the table so I... oh Once again it is spilling over <laughs> and as you can see it's a uh, it's a dish which any idiot, this one included, should hopefully be able to cook. Right. Yeah. Perhaps maybe do another, another 30 seconds or so, but in fact, no, we'll call that done. That's good. So, yeah, turn the, turn the hob off. And just take some cross to the colander. Let's get that out of the way. Right, do it again. That. Right, so now I'm just going to put that there, just get the last bits of water out, bring across the tomatoes, which will hopefully all stay in place, and the rocket. And uh, just find the level two. Okay, so what we're going to do next is just put the, the pasta. Into this real nice dish for serving. Add the tomatoes and just uh, add some rocket as well. And then just uh, yeah. you want some fresh basil. <laughs> Drizzle a bit of the olive oil over the top. And then as I have clean hands, I'm just gonna. It's in fact um. incredibly hot, I'm not going to do it. You can use the spoon instead, uh, just get this What about the pepper? Nice and set in, yeah, and uh, also need to... Yeah, some tongs would be perfect. That's great. Um, so just, yeah, get the uh, olive oil mixed in with everything else. Mm. And get some black pepper, just, uh, just ground in as well. How much black pepper would you like? Again, now? we are now two people cooking you in a dish. <laughs> this is how we roll. Yeah. So that should uh, actually do have tea on the black pepper. Just get that stirred in. And uh, then I'm just going to add some more of the rocket on top. As you can see, nice. Parmesan? portion which we should feed for. Uh, Parmesan you can either put on uh, now or on the plate, but we're just going to put a little bit on now. <laughs> This is going to have this really great thing. That looks beautiful. And it looks like the Italian flag. It does. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm just put a couple of little bits of tomato <laughs> on top just for and the garnish. And where's, where's the clock? How are we doing for time? I have um, no idea anymore. Here. Great. Eight minutes and eight seconds. There we go. Done in under ten minutes. Brilliant. <laughs> great to eat. Enjoy. There we go. Right. Mmm, tempting, isn't it? Mm. 